morning. Coach Burt, 650. 650 this morning, leaving F45. Okay, if you haven't been into F45, wherever you live in the country, I want to encourage you. Pretty soon, you're going to be able to work out with me anywhere in the world virtually. Good, man. Good morning, Angel. I'm starting today a series, 21, 23, 25, 28 days. Hey, don't know, but it's going to be a bunch. A bunch of value, Anita Hill. Brian Covey. I'm doing a 21 to 28 day series on Flip the Switch. How do you activate and reactivate the prey drive in a person? And man, whew, this is so critical to your big time success, Brian Covey, because a lot of people really, really don't understand this concept of how to activate the killer instinct in another person. And if you watch me, you know that, that I'm, I'm moving toward this being the number one activator of prey drive in the world. Prey drive is an instinctual ability to see something that you want, that you need, and to have the intensity and persistence to pursue it. Now, this is simple. People fall off the wagon. Number one, they don't activate it. Number two, they don't know how to reactivate it. Number three, they don't have the intensity and the persistence. Garrett Smith, good morning. So what I see, like eight people this morning uh, woke up, said they couldn't come to the workout. Good morning, Jared. Right? Eight people committed last night to working out today, and this morning they decommitted before they got there. And I get it, man. I get it. There's life happening. You're up all night. My wife was one of those because she was up all night with our son. And and so there's things that happen in life. Well, we got to find a way to 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 create this killer instinct every day because here's what I noticed last night I was doing an event and I went for two hours it was late at night I was tired and there were people that were there Amanda Beaner that wanted to make a decision the word decide as you know means to kill off kill off something well I know when in a moment of fatigue it's so easy to say man I'll just follow back up with you tomorrow I'll just follow back up. we'll follow back up with you no the prey drive is the killer instinct to say, what would stop us from doing it right now? I know it's nine o'clock, I know it's late, I know you're tired, but you do wanna do this, don't you? And it's like, what I'm trying to do is, is teach you how to go one more step, one work one more muscle, make one more phone call, send one more text message, push one more time. Like to me, what a good coach does, Sean Puckett, is activate this killer instinct in you. And, and it goes back to when I was a basketball coach. And I used to teach my players a simple concept. When the other team puts their hands on their knees, it's over. Right? When other people put their hand, when the other team puts their hands on their knees, I say, ladies, look at them, look at them girls over there. Where's their hands at? They'd be down on their knees, huffing, I'm puffing. I'm like, it's over, man. Now is the time to boom, killer instinct. One more basket, this game's over. One more play, one more stop. And so what I'm trying to teach you in the business world is, man, one more play and it's over. One more step and it's over. One more deal and it's done. One more tag, one more touch. When you're tired, when you're fatigued, when you're exhausted, when you don't think you can go anymore. Okay? Thank you, Garrett Smith. Learn how to close in my class. So listen, closing is bringing two things together, man. Look up the word close. It means to bring something together to an end, Chad Hewitt. It means to bring something to an end. Some of us have business deals out there, man, and they're just floating around in the universe, and you don't have the killer instinct to say, what would stop you from doing it right now, man? I told a guy the other day, so man, I'm not chasing you. I'm not trying to convince you. I'm not going anymore. I'm not, I'm not calling you back, okay? If you want to do it, do it. If you don't want to do it, don't do it, but I'm not, I'm done chasing you. There's seven billion people on the planet. I presented an idea. I can't help you till you commit. You got to ask yourself a simple question. Would your people be better off with me in your life or not? You think you would produce at a higher frequency with me behind you or not? That's it, man. You, you decide. You kill something off. That's, that's prey drive. So what I'm going to be teaching you over the next 21 days is how, how do you activate your prey drive when you wake up and you don't feel like it? Lanise Norris, how do you... How do you activate the killer instinct when you don't feel like going to work? How do you activate the killer instinct when you just got knocked down? 
How do you activate the drive in your business? How do you activate the drive in your team members? Because the good Lord knows there's so many people that have so much potential. And potential, folks, Phil Fulmer, the coach of Tennessee, used to say, uh, what's the definition of potential? And he used to say, you ain't there yet. Well, in some ways, hey, oh, Phil, you wasn't there yet either, big guy. So when you think about it, potential is there's so many people that have this dormant, latent, and undeveloped potential, and it's sitting there. For some of you, it's in your spouse. It's in your girlfriend. It's in your boyfriend. It's in your kids. It's in your coworkers. It's in your, and you're sitting there looking at them going, man, if I could just activate the drive. Now, you're going to use terms like motivate if they just had some motivation if they just had some energy all of that lee weaver is prey drive it is instinct activation of instinct and killer instinct to see something and go get it what could stop you from doing it right now man i can't help you till you commit but once you commit i'm not gonna let you fail would you be better off of me in your life or worse off of me in your life would you hit your goals or would you not hit your goals on a scale of one to ten how serious are you about this look at all these Look at all these activators of prey drive that I use. So I'm gonna be teaching you as part of this series, this 21, 28 day series, and go ahead and put on your calendars, October 6th, I'm gonna be doing a webinar. There's two things I'm gonna be giving you during this period, I'm gonna be giving you a lot of things, but one is a free night down in Nashville at the hangar with all the private jets. That will definitely activate and reactivate your prey drive, folks. Okay, October 1st, all of you are welcome to come. I'd love to meet you in person. If you watch my videos, Okay, I'd love to just get you down there to the hangar, man. Get that prey drive activated. Open that dreamer up. We're not letting our dreams go to die, folks. We're bringing dreams back to life. You had a dream, you let that dream go to die. So October 1, down at the hangar in Nashville, you can see my plane. You can see uh, Chuck McDowell's plane. You can see all, all these people's private jets. And I'm going to do a session on dreaming. I had, I had a dream when I was 30-something years old to become the next Stephen Covey, Tanya Ralston, to be the next major influencer in the world. That was my dream. And I was reminded lately, man, I'm not giving up on that dream. So October 1, I'm going to be doing a free event down at the hangar. Come down and join us, man. Have some food. Have some entertainment. Get in one of them private jets. See what it feels like. That's number one. Number two, October 6, I'm going to be doing a free webinar on how to activate and reactivate your prey drive every day. Some of you have so much talent. The good Lord has blessed us with so much talent, man. Uh, Maxwell said this best, God's gift to us is a potential. Our gift back to God is activation of that potential. Good morning, Mary Lee. Well, Mary Lee's in there getting better last night. That's what I like about her, showing up, showing up. So I want to tell you, thank you guys. Over the next 21, 22, 25 days, I'm going to be bringing you something every day on this activation of Prey Drive. I'm going to be giving you some free events. I'm going to be uh, in your life as much as possible, helping you during this period. Uh, I just left F45, my favorite place to work out. Good morning, Candace Van Bieber. And uh, man, I'm just trying to help. I'm trying to use my talents to help the world. Free t from 20 to 30, I was selfish. It's all about me, my life, my team, how I could win. 30, I started to shift a little bit. 40, I started to say, what can I do on planet Earth, man? I got to do something big, not something small. I got to I gotta activate the prey drive. I got to be the number one guy in the world at activating prey drive in people, that killer instinct. So I want you to start thinking, what do you want to be known for? You know, I've given at least two eulogies at two different funerals. And the saddest thing is, man, I, there wasn't anything to say. I'm asking the family, what did they do? Well, they really didn't do anything. What asking the coworkers, what did they do? Well, they really didn't do anything. They just kind of showed up every day and went through the motions. And I'm like, man, I don't want to be like that. Okay? I don't want to be like that, Heath. I got to take the talent and distribute it to the world at the highest frequency that I can, man. And that's what I'm trying to encourage and re-encourage you. So I'll close with this. The word discourage means to take courage away. Okay, Ryan Shive. The word encourage means to give courage. Be a person today that encourages people to perform at such a high frequency that they are gravitating. You're emanating off this, this energy. It's like, man, I want to be involved with what that dude's doing because that dude's going places. You want people saying that about you. I want people saying that about me. 
So every day I gotta activate that killer instinct. I gotta make the extra phone call. I gotta make the bump, the nudge, the invite. I gotta make the ask, guys. And man, it takes killer instinct in today's world. It is a, a competitive world, Sean Vernon, Kevin Jones. I gotta teach my kids how to thrive in a modern and competitive world. How do we help you win when, it, when man, it is tough? I was telling those small business owners last night at that SOS. I was like, man, I'm telling you, one of the things you got to learn about running a small business is how tough it is, how much money you need to generate to, to really, really, really be successful, right? You got to really figure this out. So I'm here. I believe everybody needs a coach. Thank you this morning. Pray drive activation. You know, I love you. If I can help you in any way, I'd like to see you October 1 at the hangar in Nashville. Email Megan at CoachBurt.com. She'll get you down there. If you want to be on my webinar, we'll post a link for my webinar October 6th on how to activate and reactivate that drive every day. Let me tell you something. you got potential. Now it's time to do something with it. Come on, Sonia. Have a great day.